sort of an issue. Okay, October 7th, I was shown one minute, uh, you know, I stopped in an OUI, witnessed a gun draw, filed the complaint November 11th, was shown one minute of video November 16th, okay, of the OUI by Paul, Commander Paul Hansen. Mm -hmm. He said that this was the time I wanted to see. It has a different officer with a hat on, overhand flashlight, and Andrew Fitzpatrick, who is the officer who was at my door from 15 seconds after I arrived on scene, demanding ID. So what they showed me July 6th was the officer in two places at one time. A vehicle vanished from the screen on their dash cam video, which they claim was from the master. It's edited, 100% edited, no question. This is what Paul told me in January I would see if I saw the video. I uh, filmed every step of the way, every lie, every lie by the chief. You know, I've demanded this information from the chief. He said that it's unfounded and they can't find the gun draw. Well, they edited it. That's why you can't find the gun draw. What did they say when you told them? I, um, Paul uh, sent one email and was quite terrifying saying that this is the way the system worked and I've looked up the dash cam system online, the watch guard camera system. It has an in-screen timestamp at the top of the screen. Instead, of, in the video they showed me, there's a blue taskbar. It was a 27-minute DVD in a, in a DVD player projected on the big screen. The area of the truck was darkened. And, and more than that, you know, I... So many changes happened. Uh, they clipped off the interaction between Lieutenant Lynn and Andrew Fitzpatrick where she, she hollers, give him his license back right now. The audio cut off when she said right now. And that's the time of the edit, okay. about 11.08. When was, it, was the last time you spoke with the... The manager, I believe it was uh, in May. The police. Oh, the police? Yeah. Um, probably, well, the 17th, I found a firearm in the river and turned it over to police. 17th of last month? Something like that, yeah. Um, yeah, oh yeah, Paul's had multiple, uh, multiple exchanges, but now he refuses to talk to me. Okay. Sure. C R I or what? I. Can't Yep. C A N T R E L L. Okay. Your telephone number? Is uh, 295-6818. I came in last week and left my phone number and didn't get a call back. Okay. I have multiple questions for okay. the manager. And I believe that the town has helped the police cover this up. You know, the, the street light above the incident was removed one day after I posted a reenactment of it to show how lighted the area actually is, not dark. The street light's been removed. You know, I'm sure there's a town work order for that, right? Or maybe it was hit by a pole or a truck or something and knocked the pole over. There's this new well, pole there. replacing... Right, but they didn't put the light back up. It just seemed coincidental that, you know, when I complained to the police that... They changed them with a yeah, different... Job. A new kind of light. I see. But. Right, so it's an incidental yeah. situation, of course. All right. All right, you have a great day. You too. I'll give them this message. Thank you.